What's up everybody? It's been a while since I posted a video. Um, I wanted to give an update on a video that I posted several years ago. It was titled, How to Survive um, in Engineering. And uh, obviously since then, I think I, I think I posted that video when I was between junior and senior years of uh, my bachelor's degree in mechanical engineering. And since then, I have been working. So I'm going on uh, four years of working as an engineer in different roles. Um, I've also worked for a couple different uh, companies now. And I think it would be worthwhile for me to give you a little information on my perspective today compared to my perspective when I first um, put out a video. So. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put together a couple of different videos talking about different subjects. I'm going to try my best to uh, provide feedback not only for myself but from other engineers that I know, friends of mine who work either in the same company or other companies, um, in mostly in one field, uh, which I'll tell you about right now. And uh, over time, maybe I can reach out to people in other fields and get feedback from them, different disciplines of engineering. As you may or may not know, I'm a mechanical engineer. Um, but I think it'd be interesting to get uh, perspectives from different uh, engineers from in different roles as well. So just briefly, um, currently I'm a manufacturing engineer for a company in Florida. Uh, we we uh, create replacement parts and we provide services for uh, industrial gas turbines and um, I've worked for that company uh, ever since I graduated from school. Uh, while I was in school I worked at uh, internships and I did some contract work so I was kind of working part-time and going to school um, I would say part-time the last year or two of, of uh, university and uh, yeah I, I just have um, a lot of new insight I think that is is worth uh, sharing with you all in a series of videos uh, for help helping and quote I would say mentoring younger engineers and myself people just a couple of years um, behind me and uh, my last video was focused more on you know techniques for succeeding in engineering I think I can update that video and although the message is going to be very similar or even pretty much the same but um, I also want to give some new insights on what it is to be an engineer so what it's like uh, from a day-to-day -day perspective uh, being an engineer. What are my roles? What are other people's roles? What are the tasks you'll see? Um, and I think that that can be pretty helpful uh, to people because I remember as I was going through school it was not 100% clear what specific uh, tasks um, I would have as an engineer. And I think that that's understandable because, um, just one second. Mita! Mita, don't get wet. I don't have a change for clothes. It's my son's playing in the water. Um, here's my dog. <laughs> so, let me go ahead and show you. Uh, well, I can't show you efficiently, but I'm here in Florida. We're on the beach. And it's um, it's just beginning of November, and uh, it's beautiful weather down here. So I I sort of lost my train of thought, but basically I want to give an overview of what um, what it's like to 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 be an engineer day in day out in in my role, um, and. Uh, and others as well, as, as, as many people are willing to share their uh, experiences, you know, I'll, I'll do my best to put them on the site and, uh, and help people out that are also in other uh, disciplines. 
So I'm gonna wrap it up really quick. Uh, you'll see some videos. Probably the first videos that I put out there um, will be about my experiences. Uh, right now I work as a manufacturing engineer. Um, I've worked as a service engineer as well. And in service engineering, I've put out, um, or I, not put out, I have worked in a combination of roles um, as a gas turbine tuning engineer and as well as a hardware assessment engineer. And what I found funny is that like, you can't find good descriptions of what exactly those roles do. That's partially, online at least, that's partially because engineering in general is so broad and you have uh, just a, it, it's like an endless amount of different roles and responsibilities you could have depending on your position. So look for more videos coming and I'll give you an update as soon as I can. All right, thanks, bye.